this is exciting this is spontaneous please watch the whole video so let's crack on so let's see what we have next so I've got fried rice here as you can see so and I've got another rice here it's a curry chicken with uh, sweet corn uh, but I'm going to take out the drumstick so I just have rice so it's all my leftover rice uh, don't get stuck put it there and I got another container of rice seems to be eating a lot of rice in this house but it's all different so got another container of rice so let's see what we can do with this rice let's crack on so the first thing I'm going to do is cut up my onion left from my noodle step right you don't have to cut like the chef's cut you know we're so pressured to do things the way people do it just cut your onion the way you want to cut it no pressure it tastes the same whether it's sliced perfectly or just sliced the way you want it it's still just an onion right yes yeah, so I'm going to switch on my stove I got my wok here with my oil she's warming up okay so my oil is warm so I'm going to put my onion in necessarily going to put any seasoning in here but let's see because there are uh, two of the three rice already have seasoning in it so let's just see how it goes uh, but I started off with the onions I really hope you watch this video until the end so you know you know how this all pans out right I'm just, just interested to see because even I'm just you know going along and just kind of like seeing what going to come out of it so I think I'll add my just regular rice first it's just because it doesn't have any flavor just add it to my still a bit frozen that's how you know that I'm telling the truth it's been in the freezer yes I can break that up a little bit. Okay, and then I'm going to add my rice with the curry, and then I'm going to add my plain some rice. All together. Don't be scared. Food is up. Don't be scared to try things. And then, and then I'm going to add, remember my leftover onions and tomatoes? I'm going to add that in. I really don't know how this is going to taste. So I'm just going to lower my heat a little bit. And then I'm going to cover it to cook and then just check in. Everything has turned out so great so far. This is such good rice to make like a burrito or like I'm just going to put it in a wrap for my kids if they want that you know or you can just have it like that with a salad it's so tasty I'm not surprised because I'm the queen of leftovers actually <laughs> yes I can make a, a meal with anything I don't need all the ingredients to be able to make a tasty meal no I don't I use what I have like I said, cooking is art. I'm going into my pot with 
the metal spoon that I even scratched it in the car. Look at that. It's got corn in there, got rice, got onions, tomatoes, a bit of chicken. Flavor, flavor, flavor. Saving your money. Eating well while saving money. 